It's Booty Quake here from Roller Derby Athletics. Today's workout is all upper body and core. As you may have heard, I recently injured my left leg at RollerCon. I pulled my calf muscle pretty badly. So now I'm off crutches and I'm definitely weight bearing, but I'm definitely not doing any jumping around, barely walking. So this gave me a good chance to design a workout for all those people out there who always email me and say, I've sprained my ankle or I've, I'm in a cast and I'm still looking for something that I can do to work out while I can't use my legs. So this is it guys, it's all upper body and core and it's great for anyone who wants to improve their core strength and their upper body strength. As with any workout, and especially if you're injured, if something doesn't work for you, you have to listen to your body. Modify if you need to, or just skip that exercise entirely. I'm gonna show a few modifications as I go, and I'm gonna do all my push-ups from my knees because I can't do them from my toes. Uh, that might not work for you if you've got a knee thing, so just figure out what does work for you. Maybe even just from a hands and knees position, you can do your push-ups, for example. Okay, so listen to your body, be healthy, and let's go have a great workout. There you go guys, that's the routine. So I want you to repeat that through twice, and if you're feeling really feisty, you can do it three times through. I hope that this workout works for you with your lower leg injury, or if you're healthy too. If you like this workout, please feel free to share it with a friend, give it a like, and help a teammate or an injured teammate be a stronger roller derby athlete. Do you have a lower leg injury right now? And if so, have you found something that's really great that allows you to work out without bothering your injury? I would love to hear about it in the comments below on the blog post at rollerderbyathletics.com. Thanks so much for tuning in. Till next time, I'm Booty Quake. I just kicked your ass. Now you can go kick somebody else's.